Did you know there are over 10,000 known species of ants worldwide? These tiny architects build some of the most intricate societies right under our feet. Let us explore the fascinating world of ant colonies, where every worker is vital to the colony's survival. So let's get right to it. Imagine a bustling metropolis, alive with activity 24-7, where every individual knows their role and purpose. No, we're not talking about New York City or Tokyo. We're diving deep into the complex world of ant colonies. Ant colonies are a fascinating aspect of nature. These tiny creatures, often overlooked in our daily lives, have built intricate societies that rival our own in terms of complexity and organization. Each colony operates like a well-oiled machine, with every ant playing a specific role, be it a worker, soldier, or the all-important queen. Did you know that some ant super colonies can stretch over 3,700 miles, housing billions of ants? That's equivalent to a city stretching from Los Angeles to New York. Such vast colonies are a demonstration of the ants' incredible ability to cooperate and communicate. In this vast city, the queen reigns supreme. She is the heart and soul of the colony, responsible for laying all its eggs. Some species of ants, like the Formica aquilonia, have queens that can lay thousands of eggs in a single day. These eggs hatch into larvae, which are well cared for by worker ants. As they grow, these larvae will metamorphose into pupa and eventually emerge as adult ants, ready to take on their roles in the colony. But what's even more fascinating is the division of labor. Worker ants, the unacknowledged heroes of the colony, tirelessly gather food, tend to the young, and defend the colony from threats. They use pheromones to communicate, leaving chemical trails that guide other ants to food sources or warn of danger. It's a sophisticated communication system that ensures the colony's survival. For example, the Fadoli polygula species has a unique cast of superworkers or majors, which have enlarged heads and powerful jaws. These majors are responsible for tasks that require extra strength, like breaking down larger food items or defending the nest against larger predators. To put it simply, ant colonies are a brilliant example of nature's design, showcasing cooperation, division of labor, and incredible adaptability. Let us move on from the busy world of ant colonies to one of their most important members, the queen. Unlike the fairy tale queens we often hear about, the ant queen doesn't wear a crown or sit on a throne. Instead, she is the life giver, the foundation upon which the entire colony stands. The queen's primary role is reproduction, in species like Campanotus floridanus, the queen is notably large, making her easily distinguishable from her subjects. After a nuptial flight, where she mates with several males, she stores their sperm and uses it throughout her life to fertilize her eggs. This stored sperm can last for years, allowing her to lay millions of eggs during her lifetime. But the queen's influence extends beyond mere reproduction. She emits unique pheromones that regulate the behavior and roles of other ants in the colony. These chemical signals help maintain order, ensuring that workers carry out their duties and that the colony functions smoothly. Interestingly, some ant species, like Mycocyprius smithii, practice a form of reproduction called parthenogenesis. In this process, the queen produces offspring without mating, leading to entirely female colonies. The queen's longevity is also remarkable. While worker ants may live for weeks to months, a queen can live for several years, sometimes even up to a decade or more in certain species. Throughout her life, she remains the heart of the colony, ensuring its growth, prosperity, and continuity. While the queen plays a pivotal role in ensuring the colony's future through reproduction, the worker ants contribute by building and maintaining the colony's complex infrastructure. The nests they construct are a wonder of natural engineering, tailored to the specific needs of the colony and the environment they inhabit. The Atacephalotes commonly known as the leafcutter ant, is a prime example. This species constructs vast underground cities with a complexity that rivals our urban landscapes. These nests can span several meters in depth and width, accommodating millions of ants. Within these subterranean labyrinths, there are specialized chambers for various purposes, nurseries for the young, granaries for food storage, and even waste disposal areas to keep the colony clean and disease-free. What's even more astonishing is the ants' ability to regulate the climate within their nests. 
Using a combination of tunnel design and ventilation shafts, ants can maintain a consistent temperature and humidity level, ensuring the optimal environment for their fungus farms and their young. It's a natural form of air conditioning, perfected over millions of years of evolution. The Formica rufa, or the redwood ant, constructs mounds made of pine needles and other forest debris. These mounds act as solar collectors, capturing the sun's warmth and distributing it throughout the nest. This ingenious design allows the ants to stay active even in colder climates. Now let's talk about the challenges that ants face and how they adapt to survive in their world. Life in the ant world isn't all sunshine and rainbows. Ants encounter threats from predators, navigate treacherous floods, and even wage wars against rival ant colonies. But ants are true survivors. Consider a group of army ants attempting to cross a river. It's a challenge that could stop most creatures in their tracks. However, army ants have a remarkable solution. They link together, forming living bridges with their bodies. This living bridge allows thousands of ants to cross the water safely, like a natural construction crew. But the challenges don't end there. Ants must also protect their food stores from raiders. Some species use their bodies to block entrances to their nests, forming barrier-like structures that block intruders. Ants face numerous challenges in their environment, the Saharan silver ant is a prime example of a unique adaptation. With its silver hairs, it can reflect sunlight and withstand the scorching heat of the desert. This adaptation allows them to search for food at temperatures that would be lethal to other creatures. In conclusion, ants may be small, but their societies are vast and complex. They teach us about teamwork, resilience, and the power of community. So the next time you see an ant trail, Take a moment to appreciate these tiny engineers, soldiers, and caregivers. After all, in their world, every ant matters. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe to Nature's Flex for more mesmerizing tales of our nature's wonders. Until next time, stay wild and keep exploring.